Hello, this is going to be my attempt of showing a little walkthrough of how I set up my bottom watering system. Um, one thing that's kind of cool, with the place where I work, we use a lot of these storage totes. And when they're damaged, as you can see this one here has a big crack in the bottom. Uh, officially, from company point of view, they're supposed to be thrown away. Well, last summer, I spoke with one of the big bosses and I pointed out hey since they're just getting thrown out anyway I'd like to take them home and do my gardening in them and he said that's fine no problem so I've been doing that and I set up a bottom watering system that worked out pretty well last year and I'm expanding on that this year doing about three times more than what I did last year so here's how I do it as you can see, this one has a big crack in the bottom. And then um, you can see I went through and drilled holes for extra water drainage so that it wouldn't get overly too waterlogged. And then the next step, slide over here, you can see I have these two large holes cut in here that I will explain in a moment. And then a small one over in the corner here that the reason for those holes is I have some plastic cups down in the bottom here that have holes drilled in the sides here and in the bottom and then over in the corner here I have a pop bottle screwed into the small hole that um, as you can see I like taking um, things that can be reused and reuse them rather than throwing them in landfill. And then with the fact of having those cups in there filling those holes, you can look underneath here. I have the totes double stacked that what it is is then the one on the bottom. You can see how this one is cracked on the side here. You can see it's cracked there. So again, that would be a throwaway that then I drill these little overflow holes like that so then I pour water in through the pop bottle there so it actually goes down into the bottom tote and then feeds up through the cups into my system and something I think is pretty cool I had mentioned a while back to my co-workers to um, you know when you when they come across the damaged ones to save them for me because of this was what I was doing that I literally just noticed about an hour ago this particular one somebody during the week I don't know how well this is going to come out somebody during the week actually made a point of labeling this one to save for the weekend shift for me so I think that's pretty cool so um I just want to also mention thank you very much for you know those people who have been helping me out with saving these for me and a special very big thank you to the manager that at this point anyway I don't think I should actually name anybody but uh, um, the big shot that uh, has his little office in the corner of the warehouse and uh, I've spoken to him many times about this um, he will certainly know who I'm talking about if he happens to see this. Thank you very much, bud. I really appreciate it. And uh, the tomatoes I grew last year, and these two, you know, you can see how these two are, are dirty. These two I used last year. And then, like I said, I'm expanding on that, that I used these two last year. I'm going for six this year. Um, hopefully, I'll have some good tomatoes to share with you. So thank you very much, guys. We'll see how things go.